You're watching KPBI News 6, your news source for East Idaho. Time now for Six for Your Health. Now, last week we told you about a new initiative to help people get outside and also connect them with local doctors. The Portneuf Greenway Foundation's Walk with a Doc program continues into week two tomorrow. So joining us today is Dr. Fahim Rahim. He and his brother uh, run the Idaho Kidney Institute, which has offices in Idaho Falls, Blackfoot, and Pocatello. The brothers are also the first Idahoans to receive the Ellis Island Medal of Honor. Thank you very much for being here. It. Thanks for having me here, Tom. So in your practice, you obviously focus on the health of the kidneys. When you get in a group setting like this where people can have some back and forth with you, what kinds of questions are they wanting to know from, from you? Um, you know, kidney disease is, uh, as we were discussing earlier, is an epidemic. It's expanding fast. 26 million Americans are currently suffering from kidney disease. Just for me to translate the um, the extent of the disease or how big of a problem it is that is the catching factor that's how i start telling them and then we go from there and you mentioned it's relatively common so what do you do now to maybe maintain your kidney health so that chronic kidney disease does not become a, a problem down right. the road? Before the commercial break, we, we talked about obesity in America. Right. See, obesity is becoming a problem. We were discussing earlier, you know, one in four kids in the United States are, have childhood obesity. That leads into diabetes and hypertension. That in turn leads to kidney disease and makes the problem worse. So kidney disease is again a silent killer. You don't have any symptoms. Uh, simple blood and a urine test can actually help diagnose it and early detection is can c make it preventable and treatable. So what are some of those things then, uh, you mentioned <coughs> the blood and the urine, what are some things that people should be looking for as a clue that right. you know it's time to, to get some help here? So Todd, I mean the key is to know your risk factors. If you have a family history of kidney disease, if you have a family history of diabetes, or if you yourself have diabetes or hypertension or history of blood in the urine or kidney stones, but mostly if you have diabetes and, and high blood pressure, then you are at risk, and that should lead you to look for more reclues. And so what are some of the treatments then that, that you prescribe so that people don't get to that point where they need to be on a transplant list or, right. they, or they're doing dialysis? You know, a lot of times it's a lot simpler. In, in I would say at least one-third of my, my practice, we come across patients who are taking anti-inflammatory drugs to access like, you know, uh, Motrin, Aleve, blah, blah, and in these meds, changing those habits. Obviously, um, working with obesity and weight loss exercise is very helpful, and that's, again, you know, which uh, Walk with the Doc program is all about. Right. Well, as you mentioned, the Walk with the Doc program is tomorrow night. Uh, they are starting it at 6 o'clock, so there's a po uh, place for you to meet. The group will be walking the Red Hill and Melton Trail. So they're meeting on Barton Road uh, and 5th on the cemetery side. Again, that's tomorrow night at 6. Thank you very much for being here. We appreciate it. Thank you, Todd. All right.